Good day, good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Offense, and this is Trend Lines Trader, a YouTube channel where we do our daily analysis and sometimes we go live uh, on the New York opening session. Unfortunately, today I don't think we will go live because of the struggle that we have in our country, in my country, South Africa. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're struggling with the electricity or power cuts since well we are on the stage four of the load shading the things that we come across usually the power will cut around 3 p.m 4 p.m and those are the time of opening session new york opening session in south africa our time zone is from 3 30 yes the opening market is at the new york open market session is at 3 30 and in new york usually is at 9 30 a.m so ladies and gentlemen let's not waste any time i'm not here for breaking news that's another topic for another time let's focus on our chart i'm gonna start with the dxy the dollar index so i'm currently using the what do you call um using the index dollar index to check on the dollar strength to check where the dollar strength relies or goes let's go on i'm on the four hourly time frame i want you to witness that currently our dollar is bullish we can see that dollar has been very bullish but there is some uh structure that shows us that the price might lose its strength as we can see dollar was bullish and when it reached this level it started to build up this uh ascending triangle we managed to break that level the price pushed towards the upside the mouse is very fast today okay we managed to break this level as you can see that uh, resistance the price pushed towards the upside when we approach our diagonal support zone that we we had previously the price managed to break and push towards the downside as you can see we found the price found the support around this uh, horizontal support or previous horizontal support level you can see the price is respecting the level and it's still around or place around it it could respect or continue with the bearish momentum and but one thing that i can tell you the price could continue with the bearish momentum as we can or as we witness that the bullish momentum seems stronger than the bearish we had the higher high and this is our lower high currently so if the price continues it will break this level to give us that lower low yes so we can say that the dollar strength is bearish if we continue with that let's not waste any time let's check on our next instrument which is nasdaq 100 ladies and gentlemen ah yesterday i almost took a loss or i almost i closed i closed my i closed my entries or my trades very early because i witnessed that i was wrong i was going the wrong direction but i ended up uh continuing with the price ladies and gentlemen i want you to witness this let me clone it let me clone the trend line it's easier when you clone the trend line to make that second line of the channel ladies and gentlemen we can tell that our price was very bearish or oh, it's still bearish currently this is what we are having or this is what the price presenting to us we are still having or this is our lower low currently and this is our lower high excuse me this is our higher high actually it's the cu current highest level that we still need to break 
so at the moment the price is at this level one thing that i can tell you i'm still looking for that lower low to for the price to form that lower low as you can see the price has been pushing uh pulsively towards the downside then we had that correction or corrective move and pulsively towards the downside i'm still looking forward to have the next corrective move since well the price has been or oh, it's at this diagonal support zone so this is our four hour time frame if i zoom in i want to you guys to understand something right here i want you guys to see something as we zoom in we are having the inter inter channel remember that name let me let me clone this so that i can i mean undo i wanted to pick up this one yeah so since well we are having this inter channel i hope this makes sense since well we are having this inter channel yesterday i was expecting the price to break this level but you know i don't move the market i'm not the market mover there are market movers out there as i was expecting the price to break this level the price okay this level it's very significant it's very important as you can see it it's our previous support the price respected the level a couple of times and broke out of it retested presented resistance price pushed towards downside retested resistance and yesterday it was around this level i was expecting for the break out but the price didn't break the level respected the level i was looking for the price to reach this um diagonal resistance maybe break it and push towards our overall resistance that is over here i hope this makes sense to you do you see what i see ladies and gentlemen i hope this makes sense to you but the price didn't make that uh breakthrough it continued with uh with the trend as you can see that it's a bearish trend the price pushed towards the downside to continue with the trend and yet when the price continues with the trend yes we we have to follow and trade what we see but at the moment i can see that the price is presenting something like a bullish flag i hope this will be a bullish flag if it's not a bullish flag it will be um a rejection because of the price is at this support or the price reach the level that support the level and i'm looking forward for the price to continue with the corrective move so if it doesn't continue with well, this corrective move it means that the price will break the level and present the lower low if it breaks it will continue with that um, bearish movement this is for hourly time frame ladies and gentlemen witness something here as the price was presenting this type of structure to us this is what i was looking forward for uh, i hope it will go straight there yeah, there we go this is what i was hoping for or this is what i found or what i witnessed but the price didn't respect the setup as you can see i witnessed the head and shoulder and this was my neck i witnessed the head and shoulder or noticed we had a head and shoulder pattern inverted head and shoulder pattern but the price didn't break uh, through the neck so this is a type of um or some of the advices we always advise uh people or to respect or we always what is that the key this is the type of uh, advices that we always sub advise people i'm sorry about that excuse me we always advise people that 
wait for the price to give you or uh, to show you its direction don't just trade because you think you know it will break wait for the price to make its move and trade what the price presents to you i want us to focus on this since well i was looking forward for that breakthrough but the price didn't break through look at this ladies and gentlemen as you can see the price had or oh, was very bearish with this big momentum movement was pushing strongly towards the upside the price had a um, uh, pullback the price pushed towards the upside and had a small pullback the price pushed went bullish again but you can see it was losing momentum you can see that this bullish uh, strength here it was very stronger or they are very stronger than this and now the price was losing momentum can you see that the price was making this type of moves so if you if you witness or notice this type of momentum the price is losing momentum you can see that when it reaches this uh level the resistance the previous resistance right here the price started giving or presenting those um those bearish candlesticks and it continued with the next candlestick and one thing that i want you to witness is that if we look at this candle it was around 11 a.m south african time frame so during this time the price was clearly presenting selling uh momentum they was clearly presenting or showing us that the sellers are in charge so during the opening session which was uh which was the next candlestick this was around 3 p.m during the opening session you can tell that the price is going bullish i mean bearish because look at that big fat bearish candlestick the next one was a big fat bearish candlestick also so you can tell that the price was a very bearish with those type of candlesticks so look at this now the price is presenting a bearish flag i will look for the breakout before i place my sell or before i continue with the sell positions but one thing i can say is that the price rejected this level before we could still witness the same rejection or the price could reject and push towards our diagonal resistance i hope that makes sense to you ladies and gentlemen ladies and gentlemen i really thank you so much for watching this video uh those who haven't subscribed please don't forget to subscribe and those who haven't liked the video don't forget to like the video and please remember that we have um social media we are still on um or we are still on the social media as you can find our social media handles on the link i mean the link is on the description down below please do not hesitate to communicate with us uh, let's build the community it's nice it's nice let's build the community and those who are subscribed those who subscribed to the channel i really like to say thank you i salute you for your subscribe for your subscribe yeah, for your subscription <laughs> english ne? english ladies and gentlemen let's not waste any time let's go to the next instrument which is gold uh, and i'm on for hourly time frame gold yesterday it was giving me the very nice structure actually it went exactly how i predicted i managed to grab some few cents some few cents by the way so gold was nice for me yesterday i managed to grab some few cents 
and uh, just a second I'm trying to sort out these I can see that there is a problem that is going on right here there is a problem that I'm okay I think that will do so since while we are on gold for our time frame let me reset the charts my eyes are itching I really need to, to get the glasses eh since well we are on gold ladies and gentlemen gold was bullish previously we can tell that we had this overall uh, channel and now gold managed to break let me zoom in since well gold managed to break okay this was our overall channel ne? and we also had inter channel i hope this is clear this was our inter channel and it was all inter trend there is trend inside the trend yeah so since where we broke out of it the price presented another trend inside the trend that was bearish to our trend let me zoom in so that we can focus on this so this is this line here the yellow line it's our overall overall um support zone so the price managed to bro to break and retest it and push towards downside as you can see we are still forming that type of momentum or the price is still forming that type of structure towards the downside rather so we can tell yesterday i was having this inter channel uh inter re uh, diagonal resistance and the price was around this level let me zoom in i'm thinking of this might be small too small to analyze so the price was res the price respected this level the price was around this level during the opening session and as i predicted it will reach the diagonal resistance so the price did that i was trading around uh 15 and 30 minutes time frame so the price managed to reach that level and i picked up some few cents there yeah i can celebrate for now but one thing that i want you to witness ladies and gentlemen is that since well the price was or oh, it's still respecting the setup we can see that the price is forming this type of a uh, bullish corrective move you can tell that this was the passive move and now we are still looking forward to have that corrective move towards the diagonal overall resistance i uh, want you guys to understand that at the moment the price is playing let me go to the lower time frame let's go to two hourly and witness something i'm gonna clean this now where is that okay i was looking for that eraser let me erase this okay push this i want you to witness something before i remove this so ladies and gentlemen look at this since the price has been pushing like this we found the support and now the price found the support at this level and it's a previous support as the price the candle closed above it and previous resistance right here it's easier when you trade the level with uh, each and every candlestick go candlestick by candlestick this will give you the sign or the 
idea of if the level is significant or it's important or not you can see that we this candlestick the wink is at this level retested same level this is the support ne? the price pushed towards the upside and broke the lower candlestick closed below the level it's is significant it's very important you can see the level has been retested the level was retested a couple of times as you can see this uh, hanging man candlesticks were retesting the level so the level it's important so we could see a possible pull or push towards the upside the possible bullish candlestick since well you can see the price is about to form a, a rejection a hammer a, which is a rejection candlestick ladies and gentlemen this is what i want you to witness this is what i want you to witness again since well i wanted to draw I wanted to draw a yeah this is what I want you to witness ne? I'm using the dotted lines to show you that this level it's not uh, that strong it can be broken at any time the price can break it and push towards the downside but just want you to witness that there's a level that the price is about to respect as you can see the formation of our candlestick they are respecting the level or showing that they are about to respect the level so you can see the new candlestick that is forming right there i'm looking forward to witness uh, a bullish candlestick but if it breaks this level i'm looking forward for the bullish candlestick when it close i hope it will be a bullish candlestick i hope this makes sense to you guys let's see if the sellers will push the price towards the upside but i'm not here to sit for a while i'm gonna move anytime soon so you can see we had the this was the lower low as the price was pushing towards the downside and this was the lower low i mean the lower high excuse me the lower high as you can see we had the lower low lower low at this level this uh this is the lower low the lower high the lower high and we had the lower low what did the price do boom push towards the upside to break the structure so this is a bos break of structure this push or this push towards the upside it clearly says that the price is changing the the structure the price is changing the movement and we had a new uh higher high which is the new high high and now we have the lower high the new lower high and this could be our lower high or higher high if we are still waiting to see if the price push towards the upside to break this level the the price will push towards the upside to break this level it will continue with your bullish um, momentum and break this level to form the new higher high this will be the new lower low but if the price continue with the sailing momentum and this will be our lower low i hope this makes sense this will be our lower low if the price breaks this level that we have right here the chart looks messy right the chart looks messy i can tell but i hope you understand what i'm trying to show you what i'm trying to show you in repeat this is our lower high lower high 
Lualu, Lualu. Lualu. The price broke lower high. Ne. Lualu broke. Change the structure. We could have lower high. I mean higher high. Excuse me. We could have high high. The price retested this could be our lower high. Higher low man. This could be our higher low. Yes, higher low. And if the price continues with the bullish momentum to break this level, we could have a new higher high. But if the price doesn't break that or continue with that uh, bullish momentum, we could see the price pushing towards the downside to form the new lower low. So this will be a lower low. The price will break it and form or turn it into lower low, no longer higher low of the previous break of structure. I hope that makes sense. Without wasting any time, ladies and gentlemen, let me thank you for watching up until this end of the video. Uh, please do not hesitate to like and click the subscribe the subscribe button don't forget to click that or to tap on that notification bell so that you can be notified when i upload the future when i upload the video and be notified for the future live streams you can see that we are about to have that rejection right there you can see we are about to have that rejection right there Ladies and gentlemen, I really appreciate your time. May God bless you. May God protect you. Please don't forget to pray. Prayer beats any circumstance.